this one is it's going to be difficult this one is a hanging piece of paper just by one thumbtack the goal is to instinctively shoot the piece of paper completely in half and cut it the whole way that's our goal ryan what, brianne what do you think it's going to be a challenge it's a perfect night to do it though yep all right let's give this a shot and see what happens Shot. You see it? I see it. Lanced it. Well, <laughs> let's go take a look. Well, here we are, two out of six uh, hit the paper, but we did not get a complete cut. We don't even know if this is totally plausible yet. We don't, we're not sure. So we're gonna give it another round, but two out of hit, two hits out of eight is not bad. So let's load up another one and see what happens. To help the load? Sometimes. Oh. Wow. Come on. <laughs> Come on. I see. <laughs> Plausible? I think it is. I feel like it is. I feel like if we get a non-human knife, maybe towards the fall, something like that. But let me see if I can rip it. Instead hey, of us keep setting paper up, let's just see if we can just cut it down. What do you say? Yeah. yeah. Well, definitely. Uh... We dream these shots up, but it doesn't mean. I mean. Well, I mean, you... sometimes people see the. Uh... The ins and outs of what goes on behind the scenes when we're actually yeah working I mean, on this, this stuff. I mean, I mean, I really no sights on a piece of paper. Oh, oh, a little over ten yards, I think. Where. Right. Wow. Uh, now the paper's bowed. Yeah. It is bowed because I'm catching it. You know, 10 out of 10 says you do it with the Mac Bullseye, you do it in one mag. 45 ACP, you want I know that, I know, you know, we could easily do it with a handgun. But shooting an air gun with no sights at a piece <laughs> of paper at over 30 some feet away is kind of like. But you know what? This is good for everybody to see what goes into a shot, too. That not all shots are nope. money. Nope. We, I mean, we've gotten plenty of hits now, so. We know we're in the ballpark, so let's see if we can cut this thing. I'm going to go high. I'm going to go towards the thumbtack, I think. Let me see if I can get this square away. Uh, I got a lot of paper showing, Ryan. I know. That one was super close. All right, well. I almost feel like you're shooting the thumbtack, huh? I was gonna say you're gonna just shoot the head off the thumbtack. <laughs> I thought you'd say yep. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Well. This is the last round we'll give it and, and see if we get a cut on it. But I did 
did try and shoot the thumbtack that time. <laughs> I think we got a a pretty worked over piece of paper. Uh, I think that's it. Okay, let's go down and take a look. Wow, we got more of a cut than I thought. Didn't did you think we had that much? Um, the one from my angle, I could I could see it, but yeah. My thing, actually, suggestions, guys, something that we could possibly do to set this up a rig to uh, hold the paper perfectly straight to pull this shot off. Definitely comment down in the comment section. We'd love to hear some suggestions. What do you think? Yeah, I agree. I mean, even if like paper clip or something down I here was, giving I, us some some downward yeah. pressure and you can see since we have it tucked this way do you think we should turn around and try this one more time and attach it onto here the on the side both two yeah. tacks what do you think yeah let's give it a try let's do one more guys we hate to give up here at shooter 1721 we definitely want to nail this shot let's try that Look, we do all the work and he's out there having fun. <laughs> yeah, hear him laughing? What do you think, guys? Look straight. Look straight to me. Those works of art. Oh, no. <laughs> well, that should do it. Are we ready? What part is this? Part six, seven? I don't, I don't know. I think we're like four or five minutes into it. I think what we want to show everybody out there that does watch our channel and stuff is, yeah, shots are difficult. And you're watching first film or something. Like, we didn't practice this. This no. is just an idea. Yeah, this is just ad lib. Yeah, and when you're doing instinctive shooting at a piece of paper, if somebody knows the thickness of a piece of paper, you could give it to us. I appreciate it. This is computer paper. So let's just see if we can cut this one down the middle. Look how straight that is. Yeah, this is the shot. So. Oh. I got two hits, but how good are they? Can you see? Mm, I can't see. Can anybody see? No. You want to take a look from the side and see if you see that? Is it just hair? Is it just a hair hit? Just hair. Just little. barely? Yeah. Your angle might be off. Yeah. Right, what... Inch and a half at the most. Oh, here it is. Here it is. I know I'm probably in your way, but I think this is it right here. I think I was off a of hair there on that all that shooting right there. All right. Who was the guy putting 177 pellets in my 22? Like who put? <laughs> Milch. Milch. I know Milch. I know it was you. <laughs> I'm here pulling pellets out and I'm like, wait, these are not 22. All right. This looks like dead on. Looks like it is it. There. Oh my goodness, Almost. that was. Uh, I think that was one of our best rips there. Yeah. Oh my uh, goodness. Oh. That was almost it. That was yeah. almost it. So, I'm going to say this is plausible. Oh, 100%. It is. Now, guys, remember this is an air gun, it's 22 caliber. Don't there is no sights. And we're shooting a piece of paper. Yeah, at a little over 30 some feet. A little over 10, we're, I think we were back at 12 that time, so like 36 feet. That, I totally think this is possible. Oh yeah. I still have some shots in the mag. Should I just shoot a couple and see what happens? Yeah, 
Boy, I'd like to see this go down. How about if I hit the same spot? Yeah, I'd say Ryan, somebody, somebody definitely mixed my pellets up because I got ultra mags with super, I got super uh, hollow points and all kind of stuff in this. <laughs> somebody did something. All right. Wow. I saw you jump there for a second, like. I thought heart skipped a beat. Yeah. Hey! Oh my goodness. Woo! Got it. I know. You guys are like, yeah, after 55,000 shots. I know, it was turned into a nothing fancy video. <laughs> <laughs> well, all I wanted was it plausible. So I'll do a better job on doing more of it. So let's go down and take a look. We'll do another video a little bit better. Well, here it is. Totally plausible. Yep, at least we found out after a couple, many, well, it was many shots, but you can yeah. see so close on that shot, and then totally, like I said, I'd like to know how thin is a piece of paper. Yeah, fact. We'd like to, if someone can comment and let us know, appreciate it. Uh, something else, he actually, this is a brand new cut that he did when he actually split it. It's not the same spot, so everybody sees that. Don't yeah. want anybody saying. It. Right, you had shot it twice. Now that's one clean, continuous yeah. cut. So, and we did check; it was about 36 feet, so we were about 12 yards. So, well, there you go. Plausible shot. Definitely, we'll have to uh, recreate it. Yeah, well, I will do another one, a little bit, maybe a little bit longer range. This is Rick, Ryan, and Brianne. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching.